Hey guys, today this video is gonna show you how to make this pin days. For this project, I have three different designs. They are slightly different. And today, I'm gonna show you how to make this one. This one, I use skin tone color on the side and white in the middle. For this project, we're gonna set our room as a little bit here and keep your red arrows point away from you. First, I'm gonna take one single pen, start from first on the center to first on your left. And take another one, first on the center to first on your right. First to second on your left, and press one on your right. One on your left, and one on your right. On your left, one on your right. Next, I'm gonna press white bands for four times. The same, one on your left, one on your right. And going up for four times. Four and four. After four times of white bands, we're going to continue on going this way. Use orange band. Same, one on your left and on your right. Now we have three times. The last one, we're gonna go from left to the center and press another one from right to the center. Now we're gonna come back here and fill in on the center, on the center, I'm going to use orange band going this way all the way to the end of the room. finish here. Actually it's not the end of the room, it's the second to the last one. Now we're done with all this. Next we're going to place horizontal pen. We're going to take one single orange, make an upside down triangle, make another upside down triangle, and we're going to do the upside down triangle all the way to the end. Upside down triangle, we're gonna stop right here. Now we're gonna make a cap band, take one single orange, twist, one, two. So you will see three rings here. Place right here as cap band. Now we're gonna rotate our loom and start looping. We're gonna grab the first one on the cap band. And we'll go to the next one on the center. That's where this band comes from. So we're going to take it back home. And the next one is from the left. So we're going to hook it back to the left. And next one is right. So take it back to your right. Now we're going to do the center part. And this is regular looping, just go all the way to the end. We're only going to loop the center part for now. Now when we finish the center part, we're going to come back here 
and press some more bands right here. Now we're going to do the white part on the center. For the white part, we're going to take two white bands, place right here on top of this triangle. Take another two, place right here on the next one. Then take two more. Now we're going to take two more white bands. Place right here, cross from this one to this one, diagonally. Take another two, cross on the other way. Next, take two more, cross from left to right between these two pegs. Take two more. Cross on the other way. So right here, it looks like this. And for the white bands, remember press on this six pegs. This peg is this from the top here. One, two, three, four, five. So start from five, six, seven from the top. And you should have white bands right here and white band right here. So don't start it from here, because that won't look right. Now after we finish placing the white band here, we're going to come back here and start looping. The same. This is a regular looping. Just like you do triple single. Stay inside horizontal band. And grab the bottom one. We'll get to the next one. And right here has a lot of bands. Make sure you stay inside all the bands. Grab the bottom one. Okay, to the next one. And continue to do this until the end of the room. Last one, remember to hook it to the center here. Now repeat this step and do it on your right. The same, grab the bottom one, hook it to the next one, and do all the bands all the way to the end of the loom. one here and when we're done here remember to come back here and double check to see if you loop all the band the most common question that I ask is how come when I pull it off it's all falling apart that's because you miss loop the band somewhere so this is very important make sure you loop each one of them and when we're done checking come back here put your hook through here Take one single band, grab it through here, put both ends on your hook, take one end through the others, and pull it so you see a knot here. Now we're done. It's time to take it off. Now, after you're done here, make sure you keep this secure band secure. And we can hide it in the back here. Just put your hook through somewhere close by. Doesn't matter where. Just 
straighten them up a little bit on the white band here so it looks more like band-aids and here's our band-aids i hope you don't ever need band-aids but if you do you got one now thank you for watching see you next time bye